Hi Cancer, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Cancer, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Cancer. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the world card, and this is fixed sign energy, Taurus, Leo, Aquarius, Scorpio energy. So this is a card of completion. This is a card of things coming full circle. It can show like a graduation. It's a successful completion, though. A cycle is wrapping up, and there's this feeling of having put in a lot of work towards something and finally seeing the results of that. Okay, so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Ace of Cups, Water energy. The Chariot, Cancer Energy, and the Hanged Man, Pisces Energy. So this could be something you waited a long time for. You could have been very patient with the situation. At times, you may have even doubted that it was ever going to come. Um, but with, we have this new beginning in love here with the Ace of Cups. Something can finally start. There's this energy of forward movement with the Chariot. And there's this feeling of overcoming obstacles. It, it looks like it's been a bit of a difficult journey. Um, whether it is distance that has been an issue or circumstances, there's just this energy here. Something made things, it, it caused delays with the uh, hand man. But there's an energy of that it's an end to delays, blockages, and lack of forward movements. Because the Ace of Cups, that's definitely a beginning in love. Okay, so let's clarify these cards, Cancer. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the Hierophant, and this is Taurus energy. So this is a card showing some higher level of commitment. Something could be moving to the next level. It's like something is becoming more committed. Something is becoming more official here. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the Six of Pentacles, Earth energy, the Tower, Mars energy, and the Five of Cups in the reverse, Water energy. Okay, so you're moving forward from some sort of disappointment in love with that Five of Cups being in the reverse um, there's a feeling of coming into balance. So you could be getting on the same page with someone here with the chariot and the six of pentacles. Um, but this can also be you moving away from someone who's not in alignment with you. You, you could have ended something here and, um, you know, it could have taken you time. But it's like you're finally attracting new love or you're closing out that cycle and you're moving forward towards a new beginning in love. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Cancer. So we have be bold and make the first move, cardinal moon. So there's definitely an energy of forward movement, action after a period of non-action. Um, there's a boldness here. So this could be you who's having to, you know, will yourself out of a situation that's stuck. Um, but if it's not that you're leaving something behind, a whole situation behind, it, there could be a need for someone here to be uh, bold and be vulnerable so that we can work things out get on the same page so that this connection can move forward because it does look like it would be received very well okay so i'm gonna put another card for you So we have retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. 
Okay, so there's an energy here of moving forward, leaving something behind. You could even have a, a specific like um, a heart to heart with someone before making some sort of forward movement, a leap forward. Um, it's not clear if you're moving away on your own or if you're moving together because there's an energy here of um, prioritizing what's in alignment with you. Okay, so I'm going to put out another card for you, uh, Cancer. Okay, so we have graciousness and benevolence. No acts of kindness, no matter how small, is ever wasted. So there's a karmic energy here. You, you could have given a lot to the situation and it looks like you're receiving um, all the love you gave, the efforts, the time. It's coming back to you. Um, whether it's coming back from the person you gave it to or it's coming back from another source, there's just an energy of you receiving. You receiving what you put out there. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, um, Cancer. So we have surrendered to the magic of who you are. We all have magic in us, even in the mundane aspects of life. Remember that you are a magical being with a uniqueness and worth that come from just being you. Okay, so that's the advice. So that's what I'm seeing for you, Cancer. I hope you have a really, really good day, Cancer. Bye, Cancer.